a vicious wrestler. Gestapo that uh, Hans Schroeder found in Germany and brought back. Schroeder from outside. Flat of the boot on the top of the head. Now Bryant in there again trying to help his partner out. Referee Jerry Calhoun sends him back outside. Down on the floor, that's Hans Schroeder pounding Bob Owen. <laughs> now we're back to some semblance of order in the ring. Gestapo turns to Schroeder, makes a tag. Schroeder picks Owens up, drops him across the knee, backbreaker, slams into the mat, a cover, one, two, and three. That's going to be it. Gary Bryant in there to try to help, but just a split second too late. And a count of three fell. And there are your winners of the match. Tom Schroeder, his partner at the Gestapo, the time on it. Three minutes, three seconds, 3.03. Schroeder proclaiming his excellence to the crowd. Uh, I don't quite believe that, I don't think, but uh, they have just won it. Time again, 3.03. Rugged looking team, that's Schroeder and that Gestapo, I'll tell you for a fact in there. Bob Owens would verify that in a minute. Okay, we got some more wrestling action coming up. We're going to be back to it in just a moment. Is it to be in here? This took place just last night in Tupelo, Mississippi. We, we've got the raw tape up here, and we're a big upset in the fact that Wayne Ferris and Larry Latham upset Lawler and Dundee to win the Southern Tag Team Championship belts in there. It turned out to be a total brawl in there. Latham to keep the fist open, not doing much good. There's a tag on Ferris. And Dundee blasted again. Oh, Bill looking in bad shape. Comes back, though. You might know that little Aussie would pull it from somewhere, and he knocks him flat off his feet. Ferris down, and Latham comes in, nails Dundee in his run out now. Lawler comes in and exchanges the favor on Ferris. Latham back in. Billy a real mess. They have banged on him and beat on him. Going after Dundee. Third fall, remember that. Oh, Billy nailed him one. But Latham and Ferris both in, and here comes Lawler. Jumps over Ferris to get to, Dun to uh, Latham. Knocks him right off the ring apron. There he's back at it. And Dundee caught in the crossfire over near Latham and Ferris's corner. Double clothesline on Billy, and there's a cover one. Lawler comes in at the nick of time. We're running out of time on our championship wrestling. I sure hope that we're going to be able to get all of this bout in. Dundee coming back. Slams Latham head to a turnbuckle. There's Lawler in, now all four are in. covering Ferris but Calhoun trying to get Lawler to stop beating on Latham outside the ring and Dundee trying to get the referee's attention Ferris comes up from behind and nails him going to his tights he may have had something in his hand backdrop sunset flip but no referee. Here comes Calhoun. 
being held by Latham. Latham going back in. Drops on Dundee with the elbow and Lawler pulls the referee back to help his partner out. Billy in the center of the ring. Count of one, two. Did he get three? The referee's signifying, ring the bell, he got a three count. And he is gonna call a pin. Yeah, I know, our time's running out. The referee, in fact, is awarding the belts to Latham and Ferris as the new Southern champions. Waller nailed with a belt. Dundee grabs a belt. Slams Ferris. Oh, Dundee hit him right in the face. It is a brawl in the center of the ring. The referee, who is abused outside of the ring, let's be fair to him, by both Latham and Lawler, got in and gave a count on Dundee with Latham covering, got a three count, and the belts were awarded to Latham and Ferris as Lawler and Dundee grabbing the belts back are pounding on Latham and Ferris. Trying to get it stopped as the referee and having no success. Lawler bleeding where he was nailed with that belt. Ferris. Latham, the referee is down again. A wild melee going on in the middle of that ring as Lawler